Hi y'all, it's Beth here and today I'm talking to you about my fourth vendor. Um, also, I should say this is in no particular order. It's just whatever order I pick. This one is That Smell Good Shop. I absolutely love That Smell Good Shop. She, um, the owner's name is Wendy and she does customs all the time. I'm pretty sure the last time that I checked which was like a long time ago, like probably a year ago. Her tat, which is turnaround time for customs was 45 days. And the one time that I did customs, she took like her full tat time to do it, but she did ship it out within tat. Just, it was like to the 45th day <laughs> or like around there, maybe a few days before, but not many. Like I would say a little bit over a month, maybe not the full 15 days over a month, but still, um, she definitely takes advantage of her whole tat in my experience. So, um, which that's fine. You know, I expect when I purchase wax, I expect for to get the wax within full tat. So if a vendor takes the full tat time, it does not bother me. Um, okay, so anyways, um, for her customs, she actually offers packs of 36, and that's why I have 36 packs here. But for her ready to ships, she offers 12 packs, six packs, and um, little 0.8 ounce scent shot cups, which my very first order from her consisted only of the 0.8 ounce scent shot cups. And in the scents that I really, really loved from those scent shot cups, I purchased in ready to ships in 12 packs, six packs, and then um, through a customs in the 36 pack. Okay, sorry for that whole explanation. Now I will get into my collection of That Smell Good Shop. So first off, I have strawberry cakes. This one is vanilla cake and fresh strawberries. OMG, I need to warm this one soon. First off, I'm not gonna take all these out to smell them, but this one I am because first off, it's like my favorite scent from her. Actually, that's a lie. I have another scent from her that I really, really love too, but it's in my top two favorite scents from her that I've tried so far, but these are the size of her little cubes. If you are not familiar with that smell good shop, so there's the first one, strawberry cakes. Let me just get my life together. Okay, then I have a 36 pack of cupcakes at Tiffany's. This one is vanilla cupcake, buttercream, and a hint of chocolate. I also have a 12 pack of cupcakes at Tiffany's. I have a 36 pack of biscuits and jam. This one is fresh bread and blackberry jam. This one smells amazing. I love it. I have a 36 pack in the scent Gadzooks. This one is sweet red cherries and zucchini bread. This one is really good, especially in the fall, but just really for any time of year. This one is my other favorite from That Smell Good Shop. I love it. It is the scent Pinhead, and it is lavender, mint, and mallow, and it's so good. Um, this one is one that I thought that I liked, but in all honesty, I don't like it by itself. Um, I prefer it blended, um, because it's just like a very, very strong coffee. It is her fresh coffee, and the notes are dark roasted coffee bean. I have a 36 pack, and on top of that, I also have a six pack of her fresh coffee. So let me tell you guys a story about coffee. So when I first tried her fresh coffee, it was back in December of 2020 when I made my very, very first order with that Smell Good Shop and it was in a scent shot cup. Um, and I absolutely fell in love because I loved the scent of like just straight up plain coffee. Then December of 2021, I got COVID and COVID really, really changed the way that coffee smells to me. 
And like, there are some days that coffee is perfectly fine. Then there are other days that it smells so disgusting. Like there are mornings I will wake up in my house and be like, our house smells gross. And my dad will be like, it just smells like coffee in here. Or my mom will be like, it just smells like coffee. And I'm like, it smells horrible. Um, like so gross, like I'm about to throw up. And so just melting this scent after having that experience, I cannot do it. So I have a friend uh, who lives near me that I've had as a friend since like elementary school. We met in kindergarten and um, I, she loves the scent Absolute Coffee from Rose Girls, which is like just a straight up like gas station coffee type scent to me. Um, even when I liked coffee scents, I did not prefer Absolute Coffee. So I'm actually going to have um, my friend that lives around here smell this and if she wants it after she finishes up the Absolute Coffee bag, which I gave to her, um, then I will give it to her. But the only thing is, is that it takes her like a long time to get through wax because she does not melt it like how we melt it. She has one warmer, it's a like wall plug in warmer and she doesn't keep it going like 24 seven. She doesn't like have home fragrance in her whole house and stuff like that. So anyways, I am gonna ask her if she wants this and if she does, and this one, and if she does, I'm gonna give it to her because I would much rather her enjoy it than me just try to struggle through it. So, okay, I have a 36 pack in the scent Cinderella. This one is pink sugar, lavender, and linens. And then I also have a 12 pack in the scent Cinderella. And I love this one, it's just a nice clean laundry scent. Um, it does good in my bedroom, in the bathroom, and let me just show you in the bathroom, I actually cut the um, cubes in half. So that they're little triangles because that's all that I need in the bathroom and it's a powerhouse. Okay, so now for the scent shot cups i actually have done really really good with scent shot cups i have gotten down to only four and originally i had two full bags of this size bag of scent shot cups so over the past like year and a half i have really done so good getting through my scent shot cups from that smell good shop so the first one i still have is wake up and be awesome this one is sweet grapefruit and fresh oranges. The, like, these I'm going to just put in my bedroom and just get through them because I'm ready to be done. They are from December 14th of 2020, as you can see. So I have Wake Up and Be Awesome. I have Donut Holes and Fluff Nutta, which is a customer blend. I have creme brulee. This one is vanilla custard and caramelized sugar. I could have sworn I melted one of these, but I didn't have it written down in my wax notebook. So I don't know what I did with the other one, but I was pretty positive that I had two of them. Um, so I must have melted one and maybe like didn't record it in my notebook for whatever reason. Then I have Gilead, which is vanilla, buttercream, and spice cake. And this one I feel like is definitely losing its scent because it does not smell that strong on cold. I get mostly the spice cake. I don't really get the vanilla. I don't really get the sweetness from the buttercream. I just get the spicy, like cinnamon type note. Okay, so that is everything for my collection from that Smell Good Shop. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you guys are enjoying these videos. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. And as always, make sure you stay positive till then. Bye.